Hi, and welcome. My name is Catherine Popolitis, and I am a Vice President at Charwell Agency. Thank you so much for joining me today. So my goal for you today is to find new ways for you to earn more interest in your marketing approach, and also to leave this video feeling more confident in your financial marketing and communications. So the path to success is determined by your organization's unique needs, but there are some foundational and essential steps that should be taken into consideration, no matter what those needs look like. So I encourage you to stick around for the next few minutes to learn about two key steps that will help you earn interest on your marketing portfolio. So let's go ahead and get started. Step one, lay the foundation. So this step ensures that you have the right message and a solid working strategy in place, which is obviously very important and great foundational efforts in any marketing strategy. So as marketers, when we look back, the pandemic forced us to connect with our audiences very differently, right? And literally at the flip of a switch. So with hopefully, fingers crossed, our reactive marketing in the rear, the rear view mirror, 2021 should be the year of proactive planning. So in this first step of the process, we wanna give you some proactive tools that can make you feel more confident in your organization's marketing and communication strategy. And so we'll go ahead and get through those two items now. So to lay a solid foundation, strategic facilitation and message development should be part of that plan. This process identifies targeted audiences and key message points to help you support your business goals. The outcome includes a strong shared vision and consistent message that over the long term will establish and build your brand, enhance your reputation, and improve overall awareness. So the final step in the foundational process is to develop an annual communications plan. You know, once you've identified your target audiences and established those key message points, you must develop a diversified and implementable marketing plan to deliver the most measurable impact for your organization. And we all know that a communications plan is not a one size fits all. It needs to be unique to meet your business goals, right? And it's gonna include media relations, outreach activities, marketing activities, you know, traditional and digital advertising and so much more. But people are spending, as we know, more time online than ever before. It's, this is super old news, right? But it's definitely worth repeating in today's, in today's blog because it's absolutely essential that you have a digital strategy as part of your annual communications plan. So this is where I encourage you to take a little bit of action right now. And you can do that by conducting an audit of your online activities. So look to see what you're currently doing. Do you have room to enhance your digital presence? Are you not doing anything at all? Now is the time to conduct an audit to see where your current and prospective customers and members are spending their time. So here are some questions to consider. Is your website easy to navigate and does it have clear calls to action? Are you regularly writing new content and posting to your website? Do you have a social media content calendar? And are you investing in any paid opportunities online? Those are some questions to help you get started. So let's move on to step two of the process, and that's called implementation. So once your annual communications plan has been finalized, the, the last thing that you want to do is assume the work is done and just simply stop. So to, you know, similar as, you know, compare it to a successful investment portfolio. Plans must, your an annual communication plan must be a working document and it must be monitored over time. So to ensure you will continue to work towards your business goals, determine the level of support that you need over time you know, assign team members to specific strategies and rely on outside experts to fulfill other needs, such as a digital partner. So are you ready to increase your interest and generate higher returns from your financial marketing? Consider an interest earning marketing approach. At Charwell Agency, financial service is one of our core vertical markets and we have clients and relationships across banks, credit unions, financial advisors, insurance agencies, and more. So contact us today. Thank you.